Hey mom and dad. Hey Urvashi and Aman. Good morning everyone. My teacher taught me about measurement in class today, but I didn't get it. Well, this is a fun topic to explore today, kids. Let's learn about something called measurement. That's right. Do you know that measurement helps us understand the world around us better? What do you mean by measurement, Dad? Measurement is like uh, using a special language to describe how big or small the things are. It helps us compare and understand the size, length, weight, or number of different objects. So, it's like knowing how tall a tree is or how much water is in my glass. Exactly, Amit. Measurement helps us to answer such questions like it. Can we measure the length of this table, Dad? Sure, Urvashi. Let's grab a hand span and see how long it is. See, four hand span long. What if we don't have any hand span? Then you can measure with your cubit, foot span, or pace. Okay. We will measure this table again, but without a hand span. But how, Father? You can do it with your cubit. Now, place your cubit on the table and measure it from start to end. I want to measure my book with my hand. Place your hand like this and count the number of hand span. See, Mom. My book is three hand span long. Good. You are catching up, Aman and Urvashi. Now give me some examples for the same for the current objects. This table is five hand span long. Urvashi is fifteen hand span long. Great. Now you got it. Mom and Dad, how do we measure the weight of any object? Urvashi. We measure the weight of different objects with the weighing machine. How do we do so? Urvashi, Aman, let's learn about measuring weight. How do we do that, Father? We'll use these wooden blocks and logs. First, let's weigh this water bottle. Now we'll add blocks to the other side until it balances. It took five blocks. Good observation, Aman. The water bottle weighs as much as five blocks. Can we weigh the watermelon? Of course. Let's use the logs this time. It took eight logs. That's correct. The watermelon is heavier than the water bottle. So more blocks or logs means something is heavier. Exactly. You're both learning quickly about measuring weight. Yes, Aman, you are right. And you know one thing about the capacity of an object. What? What, Mom? Tell me. A kettle can hold. Four glasses of milk, while a jug can hold five mugs of water. Oh, I see. So different containers have different capacities. Like how my water bottle can hold more liquid than a regular drinking glass. Right, Aman. Now you both know about measurement. Today we have learnt about length, weight, and capacity. Measurement is all around us. It's fascinating how measurement helps us understand the world and solve everyday problems. Yes, yes mom, we, we learned so many things today. today.